Hey, what's up y'all? It's me, your girl Ariana, and for today's little techie video, I think you can see what's right here in front of me, and because you know I'm into tech and all things computer and gaming, then you probably know exactly what this is, but if you do not, let me introduce you to this baby right over here. If you're anyone who's anyone that's into gaming and computers and tech just like I am, then you obviously know what this is, but for those of you who don't, this is the colorful GeForce RTX 3070 GPU. And I'm sure you guys who have been wanting to build your own PC or been wanting to upgrade know that there was a little GPU shortage, but don't worry, they are restocked, reloaded, and ready for you to come join your little PC build at even a discounted price. So let me share with you the 411. So what's in my current PC build is actually the colorful GeForce RTX 3060 Ultra, but I think it's time for a little upgrade. So let me tell you what this baby has got in store. So the colorful GeForce RTX 3070 NB V2 LHR V graphics card comes with triple fans. It's at a great compact size and has an eight gigabyte memory size. If you haven't seen it yet, look at this new appearance and design. It looks absolutely badass, and I think it will suit most of your gaming setups. It's got a base clock of 1500 megahertz all the way up to 1725 megahertz boost, and has the latest memory module of the GDDR6. And if you didn't know, it comes with display ports and HDMI, so you can connect it to your monitors easy peasy. So basically for the GPU, in order to boost your computer's visual performance, then you need to have better graphics, hence an upgraded graphics card. Now what's really cool is you'd be happy to hear that Colorful has a restock and reloaded campaign, meaning that their GeForce RTX 30 series is finally available. You can actually get it on Shopee and Lazada. Boop! Different models as well, aside from this one, like this, and this, and you can get this one over here. Everything is discounted right now, and that promo is only until supplies last. So if you need to design to upgrade your GPU, then this is the one. And because I love gaming and I want the best graphics possible, then I think we'll have to go a little transformation and plug this baby in. Hello! Finally, we are in the world of Valorant, of course, my favorite, and we get to try out how the game performs using the colorful GeForce RTX 3070. Let's jump right into a custom game so we can see how the frames are playing as Killjoy, obviously. Okay, as I'm playing now, this is absolutely insane in these frames. They go from anywhere from 350 all the way to 700 plus. No way my old GPU could do that. Now, I used to play on all low settings just because I didn't want to compromise my frames, but now because we have an upgraded GPU, we can put everything on high. And we are still getting those great frame rates. Now, everyone asks if I actually know how to play Killjoy, so today I'm going to share with you my two favorite defending setups as Killjoy on Split. So depending on site A, I actually have one really nice setup. So I like to go right over here and stick a turret in this window. I like this because it covers anyone who comes up ramps in heaven and anybody who enters site from main. For my alarm, I'm sure you've seen this a lot, so we put it right here. A swarm grenade over here and one over here. This is good if you have an enemy jet on entry. What happens is... So anyone entering here and here gets stuck and gets damaged. And I like to hold this area, if I'm confident enough, <laughs> and shoot them as they enter. On B side, this is actually good for anybody who is going to entry. Even if Sage puts a wall over here, I've got you right here. And make sure it faces you. Now this turret watches anybody who enters up here through mail in heaven and also watches anybody who enters site. Now since this little buddy will alert us we've got to put of course an alarm bot. I like to put my alarm right here in the center of this manhole and one at the line over here for the swarm grenade and one over here on this little white spot. 
So how that works is they enter, they get pew 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 by the turret and it should look something like this. Ah! And as that pops, I like to actually hold this angle and pretty much shoot them as they are getting swarmed. Anyway, I hope you learned something new today in Valorant and of course in upgrading your GPU. If you're interested, make sure to check out the colorful GeForce RTX 30 series restocked and reloaded campaign. I will share with you all the links in the caption and I hope to see you guys next time. Auf Wiedersehen!